Right here we are at San Antonio KOA. We have an end site, which I do like. However, there is a negative part of this that I don't like. And I don't like these parks that do this. These parks are built in the 70s, 80s. And let me show you. Yeah, I like the fact that I have an end unit or an end cap site. I love these oak trees. Are they oak? Oh, I don't know. <laughs> They're nice trees. I've got, got a pole, a tree, this big oak tree. Yeah, it is an oak tree, which is going to be a nice shade. But this, this is the part that I don't like. The utilities are back to back, they're side to side. So I am maybe nine feet away from the other RV. And if I had a pull out, we'd almost be touching. I don't like that because they're gonna hear me and I'm gonna hear them and that's my that's the bedroom right there in the front. You know what? They can actually just demolish this part make this one big green belt and then use the other side or vice versa it'll cut uh, it'll cut down on their margins well you know what double the price you're cutting a half of your space out or a quarter of your space out increase the price by that much pass it on down especially this year there's no RV sites Available if you don't book six months ahead of time or four months ahead of time double your price. I don't get these Come oh, we have to keep it low. No, you don't need to keep it low increase your price Anyway good utilities I got 50 amps water electric and sewer The site is fairly leveled. I did have to put one level block on this side again I like trees for the end cap apparently they have breakfast right over here in this little hut every morning from 7 to 9 so that'll be nice I might do laundry I'm here for three days there's one national park that I plan on visiting and I'll do that tomorrow I'll order in chicken wings and chicken wings rice and jafran I'll have that for dinner tonight. And also find their laundry room. I do want to do laundry. <sighs> okay, I am loving the oak trees. So I am like... Oh, and the site's big enough for Wanda and also for Aries. With a little gap, gap there and a little gap. This is where you go to check in. It's nice. They have four lanes you can get propane and it is gated and they lock this gate apparently after eight and you need a code and laundry is over here and it's open 24 7 and two dollars to wash and dollar fifty to dry you do have a pond and you can go rent fishing poles and it's a catch and release. I don't know what the point of that is. Why can't you just catch it and eat it? Oh, I guess you can rent go-karts and bicycles here too. We are in San Antonio at the San Antonio Missions National Park. And more than 400 years ago, Spanish expeditions began to explore land that is now the American Southwest. Missionaries moved north out of the Valley of Mexico, founding missions and presidios. Four of these Spanish frontier missions, part of the colonization system, are preserved here. So we're going to tour the grounds and have a look.
Not really sure what these outer buildings are. Maybe it's where they kept bad children. This is where actually people lived in these tiny little apartments. And the front of the church. Okay, little known fact that a lot of people actually don't know are all the missions and all the presidios up and down the central and western coast of the United States are Catholic. <laughs> they were set up by Catholic monks and priests. They're not Protestant, they're not any other religion, they're Catholic. They were set up by the Spanish and the Spanish were Roman Catholics. The candles you press here. One, two, three. Why three? Adrian, mom, and dad. Thank you for watching. I hope Bye.